hi guys welcome back to my youtube channel my name is jemima this is the part three of the series end of year q and a if you've not seen the part one and two please go see it i'll put the link up here yes again i need to put it out there that if you ask the personal question i did not answer it so with all that said let us continue with the video if this person said Rui, it's nice meeting you online if not in person nice meeting you too fun facts i don't have a lot of people around me physically i have more people online like i'm an online person so don't think that i'm living a kind of life where i have one million people in my corner now You'd be surprised i have just one or two few people in my corner physically but online i have a lot of people that i communicate with so if you're not out of the line you're important to me even if you think it's because you are online that's by the way i just need to put this out there this person said oh, please i would love you to drop more academic motivational videos oh wow i have a lot of academic motivational videos but now that you've mentioned it in this 2024 i will certainly put it into consideration i'll do that and i would also like you to drop more videos on how you really passed in flying colors in the university okay that's noted i'll do just that i have a whole place playlist for medics that want to get distinctions in medical school if in case you've not seen that playlist i'll put a link up for you this person said i'm actually an engineering student oh wow an engineering student on this channel nice to meet you you're welcome i don't even know what to say i feel so shy because i don't have anything to offer to you the only thing i've ever known in my life is med school i really don't know much about engineering and how engineering works so i don't know what kind of tips i can give to you but you're welcome by the way okay this next person said Rina ma you are a very blessed woman amen i receive your content has helped a lot thanks for your kind words and i can't really begin to explain it but your god sense thank you and may god continue to empower you uplift you and bless you in jesus name lots of love from a loving friend lots of love to you too thank you so much for your kind words you guys have no idea how encouraging these messages are to me my god they mean a whole lot to me thank you so much for your kind words this person said th thank you for your videos you're welcome they are so inspiring and helpful thank you so i graduated with a bsc in anatomy wow nice so i graduated with a bsc in anatomy four years ago and i just got admission to study medicine ah, omo congratulations kai congrats my fiance and i already made plans on getting married next year please what would be your advice wow it's not going to be easy my advice eh, is to go on with your marriage don't wait okay don't wait for med school because med school can delay you if you're in a especially if you're in a public medical school where medical school is no longer six years it's no longer seven years it's now eight years and above waiting till you graduate will just be crazy don't do that to yourself my advice would be that you should go on with your wedding grow with your husband or, or your wife as the case may be move on with your life don't wait until you finish medical school because gone are the days when you know you're going to graduate in six years or seven years nowadays you don't even know when you're going to graduate just imagine me 2024 now is my sixth year in medical school ask me what level i'm in i'm still in 400 level so it's very crazy if you've not seen my video how i combined med school with a romantic relationship just go see those videos i'll put the link up for you if your husband or your wife is a very understanding person that's a very huge plus that's going to be a long way to help you so my advice would be move on with your marriage don't allow medical school drag you behind okay so this the next person said ruin you're such an inspiration i would advise to be teach on youtube it will make you know better and help other this person if you're the one who asked me this question i put it out on my instagram i put it out on my youtube community tab that the person who asked this question should come back and ask the question properly because i don't understand the question and you did not come back so i don't even know what this question is all about i don't even know how to answer this question and i don't want to skip it either so i'm going to answer this question based on my little understanding of what this person is asking if i got this person right this person said okay thank you for your kind words by the way said i'm an inspiration it means a lot to me that you're saying this but i don't know if you're saying i should start teaching on youtube like teaching anatomy physiology about chemistry um, oh that thing is not easy it's a project that require me to go back to study those things again to be able to come back and teach on youtube that's a lot of work that i will need a confirmation from the holy spirit to start doing that or maybe i don't know if i can do it on this same channel maybe i have to open another channel to do it but let's see how 2024 goes i'm going to put out a pool 
later on for you guys to vote the kind of videos you want to see on my channel this year so fingers crossed it's going to turn out well thank you for this suggestion it's noted this person said um for this person of course i cropped out the top part of your question because you asked a personal question i mentioned it that nobody and i meant it nobody should ask me a personal question so i'm answering the second part of your question which website can i get those medical courses from via pdf wow that's a very nice one i have a video on websites for medical students i'll put a link up for you in case you've not seen it um but mostly slide share if you are looking for anything just type anatomy of the ear slide share you see a lot of slides that you can get apart from that just check those videos you see a lot of other websites that i mentioned then this person said you said you have studied medicine for eight years how is that possible Chineke me. because where did i say that though can you let me know that video where i said i've studied medicine for eight years i have not studied medicine for eight years though because this is my sixth year in medical school i have not studied medicine for eight years i got into medical school in 2018 so it's not up to eight years now where are you getting this information from by the way i'm, I'm going to continue this video next week please this video is too long there's anything i'm going to add i'll add it while editing i'm going to go to my mouth bye